Good morning everybody! Today is Vlogmas Day 15 and it is 12 o'clock and I'm still in bed. I have had such a nice chill morning, it's been great. So I woke up at about 8, 8.30ish. I edited my day 14 vlog and that's uploaded now. I talked to Monica for a solid like few hours and now I'm editing my main channel video which will hopefully go up later on today. And I also need to go grocery shopping, read for a bit because I haven't read in a while and I really want to read this book. And then I'm going to dinner at my auntie's house which I'm really really looking forward to because I haven't seen them in like a month and a bit so that'll be fun too. Anyways, I'm going to finish doing this and I will talk to you guys when I'm doing something that's actually entertaining. So I'm finally out of bed, not gonna lie, might be like after lunch time. I said it was going to be a very chill morning, so like, I was true to my word. I'm going to go grocery shopping now, I've got my grocery bag, got my shopping list. Yeah, I'm really, really excited. If you guys have watched my grocery haul on my main channel, you know how much I love grocery shopping. So, let's do this. Ooh, hello. So I just got back from the grocery store and I thought I'd show you guys some of the stuff that I got. Some people really liked my other grocery haul and I picked up some other new stuff so I thought I would show you guys. First thing that I wanted to show you guys is this rice milk here. I've decided that for the next few weeks I'd like to try and minimize my lactose intake as much as possible. Probably still gonna have the odd chocolate here and there but like I'm trying to get off drinking milk and having yogurt and stuff like that. So I thought I'd try rice milk. I had it the other day and I really, really like it. It actually tastes quite nice, but I don't like almond milk and I don't like soy milk. So I thought I would try this one. Got me some more tuna. I've been having tuna and like salads and stuff for the past few weeks. So I got some more of this because it's ah, Well, lack of coordination. And then I've just got like a bunch of vegetables. I got a sweet potato, I got carrots, I got a pumpkin. Also I got some spinach, some bananas some berries i kind of just like went all out and got me some berries as well even though they were so expensive i think these two were four dollars each which like is a bit of a stretch for me but i was like i feel like berries i'm gonna buy them anyway and i just got some like broccoli and green beans and you know all that type of stuff and my treat for the week is gummy bears plus my friend louise is coming so i thought i'd try these ice cream sandwiches from Coles because they look nice and they're $3 and I thought Louise would appreciate that tomorrow when she comes over so I got that for her and me to eat as well. Even though I'm trying to minimize my lactose I was like yeah effort. And that's about all that I got. So I hope you guys like this little mini grocery haul. I'm just going to continue to put this stuff away. Now that I've packed away all the grocery shopping I need to get ready because I need to leave soon and go to my auntie's house. But first I want to apply my new foundation. I was talking to Monica about it this morning. Apparently it's really really heavy coverage which I think I already knew but like I just forgot about so I'm just really interested to see how this is going to go. So I'm going to do this now. I'm going to watch some YouTube videos while I'm doing it and then I've got to leave to go to my auntie's house because it's currently like just after four o'clock and I'm supposed to be there for dinner so gotta do that. Okay so first I'm gonna apply my primer. I'm just using the Face of Australia 3-in-1 primer. Looks like this. I quite like it. I think I need to get a better one though that's like matte maybe or just like a better quality one because it doesn't do as good as it could. I love the fact that it has a pump. Favourite thing ever is when foundations have pumps. Hate when you have to like spill them out. Another reason is why I wasn't 100% sure if I wanted the Fit Me foundation because like I find that just a pain in the ass. so can't wait to pump this one out. I'm also using my Chi Chi blending sponge. I haven't tried the real beauty blender before. My friend Nikki keeps trying to make me buy one, but like, I just like this one. I feel like I'm gonna fall in love with the beauty blender if I try it, then I can't justify buying it like every few months. First impressions of this foundation, I quite like it. So thank you to Kaylin who recommended it to me because I actually really like it. The color matches perfectly with my skin tone, which is like, mm hmm And I don't know, I just, it blends really, really easily. It's quite thick, which I like. It's not too liquidy. So like, I feel like it's covering things, which is nice, but it's not too thick. It's something you can like build up, which I like in a foundation. I'm rate this, I'm gonna see how it goes throughout the day. I'm gonna definitely apply it tomorrow morning so then I can see how it lasts throughout an entire day because it's the afternoon now so like I'm not gonna really get the full effect of what it could do but yeah no, I'm just gonna continue getting ready for my aunties and I'll talk to you guys in a sec. I'm just about to leave to go to my auntie's house and stuff and I just remembered I haven't eaten my advent calendar chocolate in so long. Oh my gosh, I just keep forgetting about it. See, I'm not used to having an advent calendar so like it just doesn't come to mind every morning that I have to have some. Anyways, what was the last day that I had? The 11th. So I've got the 12th, 13th, 14th and now 15. I'm getting so much better at this pack just makes perfect. I guess the best part about forgetting to eat them is that I get four pieces of chocolate all at once. Like yum. After I finish this I'm gonna leave to go to the station and go to my auntie's house. It takes about 
just under an hour to get there via the train. So yeah, gonna go do that. <laughs> I went for someone to fall over. Show off. Baby, you have to do this. I fell over before on my ass. She's selling a book. My mum can, can help you. Oh, can she? Mm. She helped me and I went fast. Go. Skill. What are you doing? I'm so Apparently uncoordinated. You're crouching. Off you go. <laughs> <laughs> you look constant. It's a great <laughs> angle. <laughs> I've seen people do it on their knees. I'll try. No, I won't try. You'll go. <laughs> <laughs> You'll fall over. Like, thinking it through. How come I supposed to balance though? Wait, it's going the wrong way. No. He's the slowest. He's like one of the little old people on the moped. <laughs> it takes you like 10 minutes to get round. <laughs> Can you imagine like this becoming the new old person scooters? Like, that would be so cool. How funny would that be? Like 80 year old women going down the street on these things. How funny would that be? I'm just picturing it. I know. <laughs> Here he comes. He's coming back. How long does that take? <laughs> yeah. Amy's turn next and we're going to film her. Go really. Stop. Yeah. And smack into the wall. <laughs> Did Harrison fall down there? Yeah. <laughs> he was flooring it. Ow! And then that would hurt we so went bad. We heard all this banging. It went right into the wall, and there's a hole in the wall. <gasps> and then three glasses of wine fell, like bottles of wine. Of oh my bang. gosh. The more you stand up straight, the more you need to balance. Don't get on the stairs. That would be great footage. <laughs> Oh, here she comes. Flora. <laughs> That's Oh, do you? <laughs> you just don't get it, Hillary. You just don't get it. Where's your hip hop? Come on, show us. Come on, do the stanky leg. I'll, I'll do that. You, you get up and show me your hip hop. This video is very helpful. This is you on the couch. Yeah, Millie's going to town. Look at that. You're doing the tweets from the 60s, Jay. It's a bit like your Bollywood stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa. I didn't even know you had that in you. Look at the Look at the Whoa. Love you. Your hair's greasy. Thank you mm -hmm. for that update. Mm -hmm. This is a great angle. Yeah, of course, it's me. You know your flaws. Yeah. Let it happen. Let it happen. Harrison is so unimpressed. An exercise walk. Is that what they're calling it these days? <laughs> Go. You are. <laughs> you are a mess. Success. There you go. Harrison's got it. See, that's how normal people do it, Hillary. Oh, I don't even have my light on. I can't see where I'm going. Uh, uh, uh.
Oh, there we go. Got back about two hours ago, and it's actually the next day, but like, I'm just gonna finish this vlog anyway. The rest of the night, I just came home, had a shower, talked to my brother for quite a while, actually. Just been chatting in the living room, which was nice, and yeah, now I'm saying goodnight to you guys so then I can go to bed. Anyways, my favorite thing that I did today was hanging with my cousins. I really, really love them so much. As you saw, I got to ride on a hoverboard, and even though I fell on my ass, it was one of the greatest things I've ever done in my life. So much fun. I have ridden a Segway before. I rode one when I was in Italy. I got to do it on the road and like it was just so much fun so that was a bit of a throwback when I was on the hoverboard but yes I did fall on my ass. Then my cousins and I went on a walk for like an hour and a half which was just so nice. So nice and we got to chill with the dogs and I just really love them all. Tomorrow I'm looking forward to my friend Louise coming up. She's staying with me for three days and that's just gonna be awesome. It's just a really good next few days and I'm very excited so that's what's happening. I'm gonna go to sleep now because it is well past my bed time and I need to wake up tomorrow so I can edit this and then pick up Louise from the station later. So, go to bed, have a nice day and I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye!